Hello friends, this is Chalpesh here and welcome again to my channel Code with Javi. In this video, we are going to talk about how we can fight against the COVID-19 or coronavirus. So this is not a technical video and if you are thinking that uh, this is a technical video then please do not watch this video because like this is all about, uh, about the coronavirus or the COVID-19 virus. So uh, there are countries like India where I live or uh, many other countries are fighting with COVID-19 and uh, especially in my country like there are tons of people getting affected by COVID-19 so I thought like it would be a good idea to create such videos to spread some awareness and resources to help people fight against the COVID-19. So let's get started. So this is a disclaimer which I wanted to put. Uh, basically, I am not a doctor or a medical professional. I am a techie guy and uh, I just like to create a technical video. But uh, I thought like this video will help uh, to other people. So that's why I am uh, creating this video. And I am just sharing uh, my views on these typical situations. Uh, and these views are my views. I also strongly believe that uh, we'll fight against COVID and we'll come out of it. So basically, uh, there are some things which I wanted to talk about it. The first and important thing is to stay home. Please, please don't go out. If you can work from home or you are not required to go out, then please do stay at home uh, because the thing is that like, if you stay at home then like it will be very less chances to get infected by COVID-19 because uh, you will be not um, meet, meeting people outside uh, your home and most of the people are staying home uh, in this difficult situation so I would uh, strongly advise you to do the same and uh, if you needed to go out then only young people should go out uh, ask elderly people especially who are 50 plus to stay home in any condition because like uh, this pe if these people goes out and they have, there are very high chances that uh, they got infected by the covid situation uh, because they have less immunity than the younger people so i would request all my viewers and all the people who are watching this video to stay home as as much as possible and uh, avoid going out as much as you can the next thing i wanted to talk about is mask so i have seen people especially in india are not wearing mask or if they are wearing mask then it's not properly weird so uh, these are the few things uh, which is important for your uh, safety and precaution. So basically mask is a necessity. If you, uh, if you don't wear uh, mask, then there are very high chances that you will get if you're impacted by COVID. So whenever you go out or step out of from home, please do, do wear proper mask and uh, it will reduce almost like 95 percent of chances to get infected by covid uh, so i would recommend you to wear a good uh, n95 or kn95 mask using a uh, simple mask then would recommend it to uh, use this mask because they are more effective also uh, wear double mask if you are going out like one a simple mask and another one is the N95 and also as I told you like there are lots of people wearing masks but they are wearing below their chin so that is not a good sign like if you wear mask below your chin and your nose and mouth are open then there is no point of wearing mask so definitely you should consider those things and you should we are masked in such a way that your face and nose should be properly covered in the mask. And if possible, uh, uh, there are uh, some face shields available on the market. So if, if you if you can afford it or you can buy it, then uh, they, I would highly recommend to buy the red face shield because that will help you cover cover your face and it will be an extra protection for you. So. 
there are some guidelines also from who world health organization uh, that is uh, uh, given to every people so i would like to highlight those thing so first thing is like clean your hand often so basically like uh, whenever you go out or step out from home then do carry a sanitizer uh, in your pocket uh, which is which should be like alcohol based and there should be more than 70% alcohol on that sanitizer and uh, uh, clean, uh, like uh, clean your hand with that particular sanitizer when you touch like frequently touch ob- objects like uh, lip buttons or or the uh, stairs uh, where you take your hand where you put on your hands on the other things then uh, next thing is like when you have cough or sneeze you should have your towels or uh, napkins there and sneeze into the paper napkins or the napkins or uh, if you don't have those things then uh, like uh, cough or sneeze in on on your bent elbow not on your hands the th- other thing is like avoid touching your eyes nose and mouth without cleaning your hand properly with soap and sanitizers corona virus can only get into your bodies via this organs like eyes nose and mouth so whenever you touch those things please make sure that uh, like you have cleaned and disinfect your hands properly then is it all you like clean and disinfect uh, frequently touch object and surfaces then uh, the another thing is like if you know that a particular person is uh, having covid uh, symptoms uh, avoid the close contact with uh, those kind of persons and uh, stay away from the covid-19 positive patients at least 6 feet away and also i would highly recommend to limit your social gatherings and time spent in the crowded places like this will make sure that like you will um, you will be less contacted with the persons who are tested positive so please uh, do follow these uh, guidelines and protective measures from who so another important thing is to increase your immunity so immunity is uh, very important in this particular scenario so even if you get uh, good uh, immunity then like there are very less chances to get infected by covid-19 virus even if you get infected then like you will survive it for sure so there are some ways to increase your immunity take a good uh, sleep uh, uh, because uh, everybody needs some body healings and our body heals when you sleep then lower your stress levels i know there are a lot tons of things there like uh, you need you need to manage your work from home you need to manage your kids i know there will be stress but like do some yoga and other activities and do some entertainment for yourself to increase your stress levels because like if your stress levels are up then it won't help and uh, the another important thing is enjoy a balanced diet so do not eat unhealthy food uh try to consume protein as much as you can don't have uh, those whey protein and then other stuffs but try to get protein from natural resources like fruits and vegetables uh, there are some some measures uh, which you wanted to take when you have a emergency so basically like uh, this is the idea i get from shruti chaturvedi uh, who is a, a instagram influencer and owner of chai pani so uh, like create a soft copy of your health insurance pack fd and other resources emergency purposes and create a folder in google drive or one drive and share it with the everybody on your respective family members then all the key family members should also aware about the financial situations of family so everybody should know like how many money you have there in your banks or your deposits then create a emergency contact list and share it with the all the key members of family like this would help you to manage things when you 
get some family emergency due to covid then another thing uh, i wanted to talk about is like when to get tested for covid-19 so if you are experiencing the symptoms of covid-19 like for example there is a lots of cough very high fever uh, and sort of breathless then you should uh, get tested for covid-19 so there are two type of test is is there uh, one is antigen one and uh, another one is rt pcr so antigen one you will get a result within maximum 30 to 60 minutes and rt pcr is depend on the laboratory where you have given so there are right now like there are high chances like you will get it Uh, within one or two days so i i would recommend you uh, to go for rt pcr test and uh, because like they are more accurate so the do get tested if you have any symptoms of covid-19 then um, the another thing is like do not treat yourself as you might uh, read more materials and lots of things about covid-19 and you feel that you are having no proper knowledge in Uh, about the covid 19s because like this they uh, covid 19 have different mutations and based on that mutating mutations there will be some uh, uh, different symptoms so i would recommend it to seek medical advice from doctors if you don't uh, sure about the symptoms if you had a close contact with someone within the six uh, feet of a covid-19 infected person for at least 10 minutes so like uh, either uh, one of your family member will get uh, tested at covid positive or if you are in the close contact with the covid positive person then i would highly recommend to get tested for covid covid-19 and the another thing is like if you uh, seek medical advice from doctor and mb they want you to take a test and please go for it so another important thing i wanted to test uh, discuss is like what to do if you are tested positive for covid-19 so basically like uh, when you get your test done and if result is positive what needs to be done the first thing uh, i would recommend you to isolate yourself in a separate room with the proper bathroom and toilet for at least 14 days so that's where, that way like you don't trust me uh, this to other people in home now uh, then do the contact tracing and the make the, make a list of people you have met during last 3 point days and make sure to inform and ask them to get tested for covid-19 if they have minor symptoms or if they feel like testing then inform, inform to your society and her local health or officials via aayogya setu app if you are particularly from india and if, if there is a, if you are from other countries then i would highly recommend you to get a way to inform your local authorities or government and in india if you don't have aarogya setu app then dial the 104 helpline um uh, lots of resources to help you in this particular situation then do not treat yourself as uh, as as i told you earlier also uh, take a help of doctor and do pre- uh, frequently communicate about and uh, your health wash uh, your hand properly like as i said like frequently with the soaps and 70% of alcohol based sanitizers and recently also who has uh, confirmed like this is uh, this covid uh, virus is also transmit via air so keep your room clean and uh, keep your windows open and have proper ventilation so that way like it will won't mutate more uh the another important thing is uh, stay hydrated uh, uh, drink uh, water regularly like every 40 to 50 minutes and uh, eat nutritious meals even your taste and smell is gone the another thing is like do take medicines properly uh, uh, that is very important and also please please do consult your doctors and whatever they prescribe to you only to take those medicines do not get medicines based on your whatsapp forwards or other stuffs 
because it, they might be having a side effect uh, and the another important thing is uh, regularly monitor your spo2 level because uh, if you are feeling sort of breath then i would highly recommend you to get a medical advice from the doctor another thing is like when to seek emergency help or get hospitalized so as i told you like when your oxygen level go beyond 90% so uh, if your oxygen level is constantly below uh, 90% so via t- uh, testing multiple times then i would highly recommend you to contact your doctor for hospitalization or visit your nearby covid hospital then another thing is like shortness of breath so uh, like during this type you you are likely to get cough so if you are feeling that like you are having shortness of breath since last 30 minutes then definitely you need i would recommend you to get hospitalized then another thing is like if your leaf and face color changes seem to bluish that is also another sign that your situation are getting worsen so you would definitely need a monitoring from the hospital uh, the other thing is like if you are getting high fever uh, more than one two days uh, there are other symptoms also like you you don't have energy to wake up or stay awake or you have like a pain in chest or pressure on chest so definitely in this situation do not wait for things to be healed automatically like uh, get a medical advice and if you need uh, then uh, please do get hospitalized the another thing i wanted to talk about is vaccination so vaccination is the only weapon in fighting against covid-19 virus uh, so uh, if you don't get vaccinations then what will happen is like you will have very less immunity against the covid-19 uh, so stay away from the rumors and visit your country websites get yourself vaccinated in india you can book your slot via arogya setu app or from the covid.gov.in portal so Uh, so there are lots of rumors about the uh, vaccination that like it it won't help you or it will uh, uh, decrease your immunity those are rumors itself and studies shows that like vaccination is is the only weapon in fighting against covid-19 viruses because like that way like Uh, your immunity will be much higher to fight against covid-19 viruses even if, even after vaccination if you tested uh, covid positive then there are very less chances to get hospitalized so my heartly request to all of you people to get vaccinated so there are some covid-19 resources especially uh, i am from india so Uh, I have gathered uh, lots of information about the COVID-19 resources, but uh, the, I am sure, like if you are in the another country, like there will be uh, more resources available on the Google. So uh, search for your country-specific resources. But like this part, I am only talking about the India. So so there are some resources there. Like uh, there is a Ministry of Health website where. you get all the vaccination information then there is a arogya setu app or covin app from where you can get the vaccination slots and you can get a appointment for vaccinations and there is one another site called vaccinate me so right now in india if you wanted uh, to get notifications about uh, vaccinations uh, then i would highly recommend this site and register for a whatsapp notification or email in this site where you will get notified uh, when you have vaccinations available for your area then there are lots of other uh, informations there uh, like you have lots of website like covid pune gujarat covid support uh, then covid care goa So there are lots of lo- lots and lots of uh, information available on this particular website and most of the time it is like verified there so please uh, do seek 
those informations and that will give you enough information about the beds availability plasmas and hospitals for covid-19 uh, don't worry about this links uh, i will share this presentation with you guys so you don't need to note this uh, links about so i have listed uh, lots of uh, things there there are some uh, sites where uh, if you need uh, plasma then then those uh, sites can also help so i would highly recommend to check these presentations and get yourself uh, verified with these particular resources then another important uh, uh, things uh, is uh, uh, twitter so twitter is right now best place to get help for covid and there are tons of uh, volunteers to help you out uh, here are the some of the twitter tags if you not know twitter tags like just read about it uh, those are the words with h signs and uh, if you click on those like it will give you uh, all the tweets with this particular uh, twitter tags so there are some of the tags which i listed but there are tons of uh, twitter tags available so uh, do search for them and specific to your rank uh, your uh, state or your city so like for example if you are searching from uh, for amdavad then you can search like uh, uh, covid uh, gujarat or covid amdavad and you will get a uh, lot of information about the covid situation in amdavad or gujarat so i would highly recommend to go through the tweet, twitter and uh, see all the tweets uh, there are some hospitals and government authorities also there are uh, uh, placing tweets about the current bed situation in the government hospitals so i would highly recommend uh, twitter to uh, see the current uh, bed availability and uh, other information so that's it like i the purpose of this video to create awareness about the covid-19 and i still believe that uh, india can fight again co corona or covid-19 virus and uh, i'm sure uh, we'll get out of it and if, uh, if you haven't subscribed to my channel so this is the ch uh, channel url uh, please do subscribe to my channel because like it will give me more motivations to create uh, videos on my channel and it also encourages me uh, to create such videos like this so please do take care of your loved ones and uh, do stay at home and avoid going out Thank you for watching this 